Hello everyone. This is a tutorial video of how to make a hollow octahedron using Zen magnets. Shown here is a small octahedron with 194 magnets, a medium octahedron with 974 magnets, and a large octahedron with 2,354 magnets. This shape might be the largest single thickness closed shape that you can build with Zen magnets. I will build this small octahedron for you and will tell you how to build the other sizes. The size is measured by the number of magnets between one corner of a triangular face and the center of the face. This number is the approximate radius measured in magnet diameters of a circle that circumscribes the triangle. And it's called the face circumradius or radius for short. For the small octahedron the radius is one, two, three, four, five magnets. For this medium it's ten and for the large size the circumradius is fifteen. I've not tried to build this shape for radii larger than 15, but I imagine that it can be done. To make an octahedron of radius 5, wind a concave four-sided pyramid with five complete layers first. That's one layer. That's two layers. Three, four, five. Then you add three incomplete layers. The first layer with chains of length five. The second with length, chains of length four. And the third with chains of length three. Then you pinch the third layers to form vertices, four of the vertices of the octahedron. Now, wind a convex four-sided pyramid in the same direction that you wound the other concave pyramid. So we'll start off again with the first layer, but this time Winding in the same direction, we'll wind it as a convex pyramid, with, as a mountain instead of a valley. That's layer one. And that's layer two, and we need six complete layers for this convex one. That's three, four, five, six. So you can tell that you've wound the right number by counting out from the center, one, two, three, four, five, six. You can also double check because a pyramid with six layers has an edge length of seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Then you join this convex pyramid with the concave pyramid, placing the points of the convex into the valleys of the concave, like that. And then you simply add a magnet to the top 
and one to the bottom. And you're done. And that is the octahedron of circumradius 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 